Hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. Welcome back for more Disgaea 4, Promise Revisited. In the last episode, we kind of enraged an entire Shinto pantheon and caused Armageddon early. So, uh, in this episode, we are going to not do that. Instead, we are going to get the final epilogue that we have yet to view. And once that is done, we can finally begin the post-game in earnest. But first, a status update. You'll see that uh, Cyrus and Sasha have both hit level 320, so I have promoted them to the uh, to the final tiers of their classes. Sadly for Sasha, this means she is now uh, irrelevant because I have started using Flan instead. She's a uh, she's a bunch of levels behind everybody else, but she makes up for that with her ability and also her ability to reincarnate without uh, costing me a zillion mana eventually. <laughs> so yeah, welcome to the team, Flan. Uh, those of you forgetting how I got her, I'm pretty sure I got her for, uh, for beating the game once. I think that's what happened. Anyway. So yeah, uh, we are going to go up this way. Actually, no. First, we are going to discuss the conditions for getting this uh, last epilogue. I will have a happy and for this, you may notice that I have placed the Defense Fortress next to the uh, Legendary Tree. The reason for that is, Valvatores and Desco are going to be step-siblings. We want to have Valvatores protect Desco from an attack ten times. And for that, we kind of need the Defense Fortress, I'm pretty sure. So, yeah. That being said, let us go into Deadly Option, because uh, there is something I want to show off that I neglected to show off my first time through this uh, stage. It might make your life easier, I don't know. It's, uh... Uh, sure, let's send Stella. This block has a warp effect underneath it. There's a, there's a Geocube totally hidden out of sight, and if you, uh... If you send a unit here, they will get sent way up here, so they'll be able to drop down easily without having to do any of this uh, block moving shenanigans I've done on previous playthroughs. And I just thought I would uh, make mention of that since I uh, only found that out uh, during a recent run through the game. <laughs> Here I come. Here I come. Anyway, we are going to get uh, Valvatores and Desco adjacent to each other. Have Valvatores defend, and Artina, you are going to do the honors of shooting Desco until uh, until Valvatores interferes. That's what it'll look like. We just got to do that ten times. Get out. Get out. Get out. Oh, that's uh, two times. I'm pretty sure. So yeah, we can just uh, sneak up behind everybody with Stella now. Oh, he didn't do it because I wasn't defending, duh. Disappear. I do believe Stella is poisoned. Three.
On a side note, I've upgraded everybody's uh, movement by uh, equipping them with a pair of angel shoes. You can buy angel shoes from the specialty stop by uh, putting the specialty shop where Mount Ordeals 4 would be. It's, uh, it's that L-shaped island in the campaign HQ. If you're playing the Vita version, you can just do it right away for some reason. It's kind of funny. But yeah, that greatly improves your uh, jumping capability. Plus, you get an extra point of movement, so yeah. Good times all around. This makes what, four times? Probably. Okay, so that's four protections so far. Six more before we can uh, be step siblings. Boiling point, we are not going to solo because Val is still over level 500. We are going to do it normally so we Take get this. the normal ending. And by do it normally, I mean we are just going to uh, be shooting Desco until uh, until Val is tired of protecting her. And we're going to let the other guys have some fun. Time to bust some balls! Yeah. This is what Flan's ultimate attack looks like. Flan, you are just the most precious sinner in role. Gives you any right to have such high evasion, Mr. Malice Bouncer? For my lord. It's kind of ridiculous. This is good. Wait, am I missing the? Yes, I'm missing this guy. just means we gotta go a couple more times. And 
This should be ten. Let's uh, finish things up here. Can I just cancel uh, Val out of his defense? I totally can. That's kind of funny. So, if we go to the campaign HQ, we get an event under the legendary tree. Desco and Valvatores make a passionate oath to each other. We were born separately, but we're going to die together. The two have become step siblings. So, yeah. And I kind of put everything back where it belongs. Yay, gerrymandering! Yeah. Oh yeah. Uh Where's Val? With step siblings, you can use protect even when not adjacent. And so uh yeah. I mean, Val isn't much of a tank, but we need this for the epilogue, so we're gonna do it. So yes, let's finish this uh, this absurd quest to save the world. Here we go. As you can see, we have the uh, the normal final boss. And what better opportunity than to uh, show off Flan's other two moves? Got Dragon Meow, which I'm pretty sure is a mistranslation entirely. <sighs> Shut up, phone. So yeah, she. Sh she chanted Durian Dragon Dranyago, just like she did in the very first game. Seriously, who is even calling me? It's probably a politician or something, I don't know. I got this. Well, that was something. <laughs> it was a wrong number. I have completely lost track of what I was doing, so thanks, Mystery Caller. Alright, I remember what I was doing. I was going to show off Flan's other skills. But first, we are going to punch Fear the Great in the face for a little while. Ain't that something. Finally, we have Holy Arrows! So yeah, that's the thing. Ready for 
me. So I should probably just save the Fawn's turn for last here. There, you no longer have an advantage, Mr. The Nemo. How do you feel about it? in style. Flonzilla! Heck yeah! And there's the credits again, which uh, you're going to skip. Mr. Bowsey, Mr. Bowsey, you know what? Big Sis is being so horrible! What's the matter, Desco? Big Sis said that she's so over taking over the world! Oh no, it's the worst thing to happen for the sister of the final boss. What is Desco supposed to do? What is the purpose of her existence? Just be a good little sister. Desco, if you want to become a magnificent final boss, then you must come up with solutions for yourself. You're so mean. Desco wants you to help her. Unlike all of you, Desco is an artificial life form created by humans. Do you know how depressing it is to lose the initial purpose of your creation, Mr. Belsey? Desco strove to become a final boss to help Big Sis take over the world. That is the only reason why Desco exists. If that reason is no longer valid, Desco's existence is no longer valid. You shouldn't be getting so upset about this. I thought you had the potential to become a magnificent final boss, but I guess I was wrong. What do you mean by that? Did you have expectations for Desco? Sure. I was thinking that perhaps someday you could cover my back in my final battle against him. Final battle? Against who? Who else? The King of the Mushrooms! Almighty God, who rules and controls the entire universe! God? That's right. I'll have to fight him eventually. We already did that, Val. And your power will be very much needed, Desco. It very much was. Roger that, Mr. Valsey. You can count on Desco when the time comes. Are you sure? Fighting against God isn't going to be easy, you know. It really wasn't. I was not prepared for level 1,000 enemies. Our journey will be tougher, more challenging, and more aggressive than becoming a final boss. Yes, Desco is sure. If Desco gets to do this with Mr. Valsey, it will be a fun ride! Hmm, fun, huh? Well, sure, we're going against God. We might as well have fun while we're at it. Come along, Desco! Watch my back! Okay, got it! Desco will annihilate God! <laughs> Whoa, that's a final boss kind of boast if I've ever heard one. She will also 
start calling Mr. Valsy Big Bro. Aww, that's adorable. Let's go as in real Big Bro. That's adorable. Desco Inferno. <laughs> I sense a lot of trouble, dude. Collect more mod and go to the assembly. You might find a new topic, dude. That being said, more is coming up, dude. So yeah, that is this bunch of video game. <laughs> Next time on Disgaea 4, we are going to be starting Mount Ordeals because uh, the rest of the party is kind of in a little bit of need of grinding. I hope to see you all then. Bye bye